previously. I'm gonna eat dumpling, I don't care. Oh, I need a If that doesn't inspire you, then I don't know what does. I actually really enjoyed it. Like, I love every single flavour and I'm kind of thinking like if I should buy it for myself to try it again during my own free time. Yeah, it did. I mean, I lost two point something. And I could see in the mirror, like I walked past the mirror and I was like, oh! <laughs> Charmin, I'm shocked. <laughs> Honestly, I don't mind trying it again. I don't know porridge, I'm nervous. I, anyway, during the weekends, I cheat so much. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I hope I can lose it. I hope my starting weight is similar to my previous, like the end of my previous challenge weight. So I'm going to weigh myself in right now and this is the weight that I'm going to start this challenge with. 58.3 kg. Okay, nicer! So it's around dinner time now and it's about 6.10pm. Yeah. And I was planning to eat this for dinner. You know, this porridge. Tongji Kul Tan Pat Chok. But I decided not to eat it for dinner anymore because like I'm not that hungry and I usually skip dinner anyways. So I'm gonna be skipping dinner and I'm just gonna be doing my stuff and I'll check back in when I'm full out hooping at night. Okay, it is currently 11.30 p.m. and I'm gonna do my way in for the day. I'm weighing in at 59.1 kg. Okay, I'm in the office right now and I think I'm gonna eat this for breakfast which is the one that I was supposed to eat yesterday but I didn't because I didn't have a microwave when I was out. So I'm gonna be eating this, I'm gonna go down to the pantry and hit this up. I'm gonna show you how I'll be making it. If you see over here, it says 15 seconds. Chip U Cho, 700 watts. So I gotta put this in a microwave for 15 seconds and I should be able to eat it. So this microwave is actually only until 600 watts. So I'm just gonna put until 600 for 20 seconds. It's that easy to cook the meal. So it's that easy to eat and it's that easy to lose weight. Hopefully. <laughs> oh, that was quick. Ooh, it's kinda soft. It's, oh, oh my, ow, if it's so hot, then how am I going to eat it from this thing? What if I burn my tongue? I can't smell anything. It just smells burnt plastic. <laughs> okay, I just realised that you're supposed to pour it out before you microwave. So you're supposed to pour it in a bowl. <coughs> and then you put it in a microwave to microwave for 15 seconds. But that aside, look at it now. <sighs> I really don't want to eat it. Taste sweet like red bean, but it's porridge form, you know. It is finally lunch time and it's around oh, 1.45 pm. And I'm gonna be trying this. So here's what's inside. We have seasoning, the sauce, the noodles. The total amount of calories in this is 70 calories. Okay, now let's see how we can cook, how to cook this. They're teasing me. Okay, but I think I'm really very hungry. I think I'm supposed to rinse this and then mix this together. Okay, we're gonna mix it now. Mm. Oh, it kind of smells like pasta <laughs> at times. <laughs> Wow! It's so spicy! Okay, it, it is plain but nice. But very spicy. And those are like QQ and 
like very bouncy. Yeah. A few moments later. <laughs> this is really too spicy. I don't think I can finish it. This meal has been torturous since the morning. I even washed my food in the water, but it's just not working out. I gotta admit though, I did cheat today. I was kinda hungry, so I ate dinner. And I ate quite a lot of rice for dinner. And yeah. Yeah, so I'm just gonna be doing this for 40 minutes, even though it's already 11.30 pm because I just got back home from work. But you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. I'll, I'll be disappearing and I'll look good during my wedding. Not my wedding, during my friend's wedding. Okay, this is day two's way in. Weighing in at 59.3 kg. Good morning. I'm currently in the office. And let me just show you something that I did last night. <laughs> I really wanted this snack. So, I printed all these inspirational photos. And I put no snacking. Shaman. I'm going to be trying this today. It's the Kobe Kale yeah, it is day 3 and the time now is about 10.30 a.m. and I'm going to be eating this. I've learned my lesson. I'm supposed to pour it in here. Then I migrate it. Smells exactly like rice, like with the tongkatsu and all, but I don't know if it would taste like that. But we're gonna try, I have high expectations. It's better than yesterday for sure. Maybe it tastes like curry on top of the rice, just that it has no rice. Then the texture is like you're yeah, biting on barley bits. Yeah. I mean, I think I can finish this if I make it even hotter. It's lunch time and I'm gonna be eating this today. Kunyak on so pa. Okay, it's all in. I knew it. <laughs> it was seaweed and noodles. And the, the, the soup. Is it called soup or the sauce? It's like, it tastes like cha soba, the like Japanese cha soba. So now I'm gonna try it with uli. Wow! Yes, I love it. So much better than yesterday. I recommend this if you like seaweed and cha soba. Anyway, this is 95 kilo calories. I'm really very hungry right now. This challenge this time around has just been so tough for me. <laughs> and what more when my colleagues just brought me some lunch of meat. <laughs> and they really want me to try it. So, so are you gonna try it? <laughs> no! <laughs> we can flee from temptations, right? Okay, weighing in on day three. Fifty-eight kg! Woohoo! I'm finally losing. Okay, I've heated the porridge up. I don't know how to explain the smell, but it's a beef porridge, and I'm gonna try it. Oh yeah, it is spicy. Very spicy. It's lunch time, and I'm gonna be eating this today. It is 105 kilocalories. Today I put hot water inside because it's like it's supposed. I think it's supposed to be hot. I just want some chili. Okay, we're gonna try the soup now. Not bad. Not bad. It tastes like fur with tons of basil. Okay, I'm gonna weigh in for day four. I don't know. 
weighing at 58.4 kg. And now it's around 10.52 a.m. And I was planning to eat this today, but I'm just too busy to go down to heat up my food and film, so I'm just gonna eat a banana. It's finally lunchtime, and the time now is 1.43 p.m. And here's today's lunch. Ramen, tonkatsu ramen. Here's what it looks like. Check the broth. As usual, we... You want fries? So good! It's the best out of all four. Highly recommend. It doesn't taste like ramen, but it's just good broth, you know? It's good for a rainy day. Finally, ending off my last meal for this challenge on a good note. Cheers to you! Alright, I'm down to my last weigh in for this challenge. And my final weight is 58.2 kg! What a tough weight it was! What a tough 5 days it was! It was not easy at all this time. So much more difficult than the other time when I did the shake and the bar. I don't know why I just felt hungrier, or maybe I just didn't enjoy the food myself. I mean, I love porridge. I love um, my porridge to be plain with lunch meat and eggs. But I'm so sorry. It's really, this time around, the Korean porridge just wasn't to my taste. I mean, if you love Korean porridge, then go for it. Yeah, I, to me, it's just an acquired taste. I would recommend the noodles, actually. Yeah, I did lose about 100 grams. I mean, okay, thank god that it was lower than my starting weight at least. <laughs> if you guys watched the whole video, you would know that my weight was fluctuating throughout the challenge. You know, it went from 58 to 59 and 58 and 59. And yeah, you get what I mean. If you would like to try it yourself, then do like, share and comment on this video to stand a chance to win the noodles that I have tried. Anyway, do like, share and comment on why you should win these noodles for you to try and challenge. And that's all I have for you for this K-Diet Challenge. I'll see you next time. Bye!